This is the Lumia 640 disassembly video. Before performing any repair actions, make sure you're familiar with these warnings and cautions. To disassemble, you need the Nokia Standard Toolkit version 2. You will also need an AV plug in the camera removal tool SS305. Protect the display with protective film. To release the back cover, press the back side while pushing up the shown corner of the top end. Remove the back cover. Unscrew the two Torx Plus size 4 screws from the left side of the device in the shown order. Peel off the cellular cover tape. Unscrew the 7 Torx Plus size 4 screws in the shown order. Start separating the display assembly from the chassis by first releasing the top end with the SRT6 as shown. Next release the bottom end. Lift the shown side of the chassis to a 90 degree angle. Note that the chassis is still connected to the display assembly with the two flexes. First disconnect the front camera flex connector. Then disconnect the display connector from the shown place. Remove the display assembly. Disconnect the camera connector. Then disconnect the top flex connector. To release the engine board, lift from the shown place with the SS93 to release the first clip. Next lift from the shown place to release the second clip. Carefully lift and remove the engine board. Remove the USB boot with tweezers. Remove the camera with the SS305. Remove the camera gasket with tweezers. Release the vibra with the dental tool and remove it with tweezers. Peel off the Vibra adhesive with tweezers.
Unscrew the two Dorx Plus size 4 screws in the shown order. Use an AV plug to lift out the AV jack. Detach the top flex with the dental tool. Remove the top flex. Release the lead flash by pushing it from the other side with the sharp end of the SS-93. Remove the lead flash with tweezers. Peel off the flash adhesive with the SS-93. Release the IHF speaker with the SS-93 from the shown place. Remove the IHF speaker. Remove the speaker gasket with tweezers. If you are disassembling a single SIM variant, release the SIM blocker by pushing from the back side with the SS-93. Remove the SIM blocker. Release one corner of the speaker mesh with the dental tool and peel it off with tweezers. Peel off the type label with tweezers. Peel off the adhesive remains with the SS-93. Release the earpiece with the SS-93 from the shown place. Remove the earpiece. Remove the earpiece gasket with tweezers. Detach the front camera flex with the dental tool. Remove the front camera flex. Peel off the front camera adhesive with the SS-93. Peel off the proxy flex adhesive with the SS-93. The Lumia 640 disassembly procedure is now complete. Lumia 640 assembly video. To assemble, you need the Nokia Standard Toolkit version 2.
insert the front camera adhesive into place. Press it with the sharp end of the SS93 to activate the adhesive. Peel off the protective film. Insert the proxy flex adhesive into place. Press to activate the adhesive and peel off the protective film. Peel off the protective film covering the adhesive on the display assembly. Place the front camera flex into place. Use the SS93 to push the front camera and proxy sensor to their places. Press the flex to activate the adhesive. Insert the earpiece gasket into place. Press to activate the adhesive and peel off the protective film. Insert the earpiece into place. Make sure the two thicker pins of the earpiece are facing the shown way. Gently press the earpiece from the edges to activate the adhesive. Place the type label into position and press gently to activate the adhesive. Place the speaker mesh into position and press the edges to activate the adhesive. If you are assembling a single SIM variant, remove the protective film from the SIM blocker. Insert the SIM blocker into the shown place on the chassis. Press to activate the adhesive. Insert the speaker gasket into place. Press to activate the adhesive and peel off the protective film. Insert the IHF speaker into place. Make sure the two pins are facing the shown way. Gently press the IHF speaker to activate the adhesive. Insert the flash adhesive into place. Press to activate the adhesive and peel off the protective film. Insert the LED flash into place. Make sure the shown part is facing the bottom end of the device. Gently press the LED flash to activate the adhesive. Attach the USB boot to the micro USB connector. Make sure the bottom of the USB boot goes around the micro USB connector as shown. Attach the engine board into the chassis bottom end first. Use the shown pin to get the right alignment. First attach the shown clip at the bottom end by pressing carefully with the SS93. 
Next attach the two shown clips at the top end. Peel off the two protective films from the top flex. Peel off the protective film covering the adhesive in the AV jack slot. Place the top flex into the chassis. First align the flex to the shown bins on the chassis. Next align the vibra part of the flex to the shown bins on the chassis. Then align the AV jack into place. Press around the flex and the AV jack to activate the adhesives. Fasten the two Torx plus size 4 screws in the order shown using a torque of 7 newton centimeters. Insert the Vibra adhesive into place. Press to activate the adhesive and peel off the protective film. Insert the Vibra into place. Make sure the two shown pins are facing downwards. Gently press the Vibra to activate the adhesive. Insert the camera gasket into place. Press to activate the adhesive and peel off the protective film. To place the camera into position, first attach the camera connector. Next bend the camera into place as shown and press it gently to activate the adhesive. Then carefully bend the flex by pressing from the top of the connector. Attach the top flex connector. Take the display assembly and hold it next to the chassis as shown in a 90 degree angle. Attach the display connector and the front camera flex connector. Carefully fold the chassis onto the display assembly and press from the edges to get it firmly attached. Fasten the 7 Torx plus size 4 screws in the order shown using a torque of 14 newton centimeters. Place the cellular cover tape into position and press gently to activate the adhesive. Peel off the protective film. Fasten the two Torx plus size 4 screws on the left side of the device in the order shown using a torque of 10 newton centimeters. Peel off the protective film from the camera lens. 
Attach the device into the back cover top end first. Lower down the bottom end and press from the sides to get the back cover firmly attached. The Lumia 640 assembly procedure is now complete.